Hi there, welcome to Dear Cyber Sue Advice. If they tell you on a date they're not interested in having a relationship, believe them. If you're on a date and someone says blatantly to you, yeah, I'm really not interested in a relationship, I don't want to get married, I want to have kids, and these are all really important things to you, you have to ask yourself why you would even think about going on a second date with them. They've been very honest with you and told you what they think and feel about what's going to happen in their future. But so many people ignore this. It is the biggest red flag that you could ever, ever just turn your nose up at and think you're going to change somebody. Because you will spend so many years trying to make this person into something that they're not. If they're telling you, even if they're telling you just to be you know to protect themselves you know so in case they don't really like you they can move on quickly because you're looking for a relationship and they're not and that's their excuse in it you should always have expectations when you're dating and don't think that just because oh well you know they don't really mean it that's not something that they're going to keep holding on to for the long term some people don't necessarily want to ever be in a relationship they just enjoy the novelty of dating new people all the time and I know that might sound like something that you could never possibly do for a long time. There are serial daters out there that have no problem doing this. So if somebody tells you they don't want a relationship, really believe them. There's no reason for you not to believe them. There's no reason for you to ignore what they're saying and think that you can change it or that they will change it in a matter of months down the road. Of course, there's always a chance that they may change their tune, but that's not for you to, to be there to try and help them figure out. One of the reasons we date is to find things out about each other. So when you're sitting there listening to what they're saying, you know, in your hour date or however long you're going to be with them, hear what they're saying. Don't make up things in your head that you think they're saying or you want them to be saying. So you think, oh, yo, they didn't really mean that. They'll, they'll change their mind after a while. Really, we shouldn't be going in either sex should not be going into a relationship thinking that you can fix somebody, you can change somebody, you can alter their mindset and what they've already got, you know, put in there. Because that's not our place to do that. It's not our place to try and make somebody be who we want them to be. How is that going to work down the road? Usually this is what ends up breaking up couples after a while because sometimes we give in to things in the beginning stages of a relationship because we want to be with them. We like a lot of things about them, but there's a couple of things that we're giving in that we don't really want to. And over time it takes its toll and we resent it. We get mad that we let them manipulate us into doing this. If they're being honest with you on the first couple of dates, that's a good thing. It doesn't mean they're a horrible person because they don't want a relationship. Personally, I don't think they should be out there dating if you've put in your profile or whatever that you're looking for a relationship and then they're dating you because that's not fair on you, but also it's good for you to find that out really quickly. So listen to what people say on the first date. Seriously listen to them because that will get you into better places down the road. You don't have to date people that you don't mesh with. That's why you date. That's why you have one or two dates. Figure that out and then don't waste your time with them anymore. If they're, if they're saying things like this to you, move on. That's not what you want. Thanks everyone for tuning in to Dear Cyber Sue. And please leave any questions you have or comments below this video, like the video, and I really appreciate you subscribing to my channel. Thanks everyone. Bye -bye.